Now I wanted to show you all the fields up here that have birds in them so you knew. Now you see the two res fields and there's this one, there's two more, up, three more up here. Ran into a, a situation this year where all the fields that traditionally hold geese were in, in a crop rotation other than something conducive for Canada geese to be in. Uh, they're in standing beans or canola stubble. So we kind of had to branch out and start knocking on some doors that we've never knocked on and ran into some issues of people already beating us to the punch. This is another field we've been watching and uh, we kind of have dual permission with some other people and trying to give them the chance to hunt it and uh, the property owners get getting a little upset that the other group hasn't hunted it yet and uh, he's giving us the go ahead to go in here tomorrow. I mean and you can tell they had a lot of pressure on them because you pull up next to them they don't even move. I mean they've been staring at polar bears and beaver all summer long. So we may come here in the morning we haven't decided yet we may come here first thing in the morning and if the other groups here um, we'll jet and go hit, uh, hit our plan B, but uh, there's a pile of birds hitting this field. They're roosting about a mile south of here, uh, but it's deep in the bush and there's no grain fields. If they got to go south, they got to go probably 50 miles to hit some more grain fields, so they got to come north and everything's hay for about the first mile up into this big old uh, grain field here. So. There, there's a pile of birds that will come over this field and, and run traffic beyond what's what's already using this field. I ain't heard from Brian over my shit. Shit, they probably laid down. They might like have got sleep. They might have. Yeah. Shit, them rumble strips. I mean, it's just like like the bowling with bumpers. <laughs> You'll make it up here. Just like bubbling. Man. And the funniest part Bumps. is right, when one of us is driving and we hit one <laughs> while the other one's sleeping, we hit it, we wake up and act, try to act like we've just. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, I, I'm good. I wasn't sleeping. I wasn't sleeping. I didn't fall asleep and run over the rumble strip. <laughs> I didn't just throw a gutter ball. <laughs> Just to let you know, Martelli, he done told us to do that. <laughs> He's like, I'm going to holler Martelli's name. Y'all wax it. We were picking on here for four days now. I still don't think Martelli shot one. Get up! Man, that is a certifiable haul. Look at it. You got the eyebrow going. Brutimus. Brutimus Maximus. Just one. Yep. Get him, Ty. Carl here. Uh oh. Bye. Uh oh. EJ. 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 Oh. Couldn't carry it that far, could No. It bled out. 
I thought it looked like we hit him. Yeah. Back! I don't have that great a mark on that one. That's right. They're right there. Down there, boy. <laughs> they come in too hot here on the back. There you go. You got them now. Get him, get him. Tell you what, yeah. Get in, more left, front left. Two for the day. in here again like this today. Yeah, let's see. <laughs> singles coming, singles coming. Whole bunch is coming. Unright, unright, unright. Stay low, stay low, stay low. They're right here. Everybody shoot straight out. Ready? Go! <laughs> we brought the heat, guy! We brought the heat, off. Is there any doubt when that first bunch lit? Oh, man. There was, because I didn't see the second bunch. Oh. I was like, wait, we shooting. I didn't say it, but that's how I was thinking. You got to go right. Is it that spot I see out there? It's going to be in the neighborhood real soon. There it is. Oh. Uh -huh. 